It's been a little over a week since Clark County issued its first sidewalk vending business license. Yeah, Jose Manuel Correa and his family, they received the license on May 29th. News 3's Georgia Costa joins us now in studio with uh, what they're saying now after speaking to them about how they're doing and what they're doing to work against this heat. We have the owners of Aguas Frescas on Cactus and Dean Martin held their first day of business on Monday and their fresh fruit water is just one way they're helping people cool off. Congratulations, I want to issue you the first um, sidewalk vending business license for Clark County. We had a lot of support from the community and family and friends. Uh, a lot of new customers that they didn't even see us on the news, they just saw us driving by, so we're very excited. On May 29th, Clark County issued its first sidewalk vending business license to Manuel Carrera and his son, Alan Carrera, owners of Aguas Frescas, located at the Circle K gas station near Cactus and Dean Martin. Of course, we're very blessed to get this. Um, we don't think we should be the last ones. I think everyone that's willing to work should apply for this permit. Carrera's father says upfront costs for the sidewalk vending business license cost him upwards of $1,200 after obtaining liability insurance, a Southern Nevada health permit, and both a state and county business license. And after crossing all the T's and dotting all the I's, Carrera's son says it was just a waiting game from there on out. As long as you have the right equipment and pass those health inspections, uh, you should be good. The longest one was the health permit. It took around two weeks. You have to get it inspected by an inspector. Since opening up for business on Monday, Carrera says he's already seen an outpour of support from community members looking to cool off with a refreshing drink. It's really satisfying seeing people, you know, enjoy their drinks and thank us for letting them cool off, you know. They, they need it because of this heat. And other than his Aguas Frescas, Carrera has another way he's helping keep both his customers and himself cool this summer. Yeah, we have our uh, swamp cooler, uh, a nice shade. Just drinking a lot of water as well, just staying hydrated and yeah, I mean, we're willing to deal with the heat. Now Carrera says despite the heat, he plans to be out there every day from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. Now I also reached out to the county who says to date they've received three sidewalk vendor applications, two of which have been approved. But for now reporting in studio, Georgia Costa News 3. All right, a welcome sign of relief for a lot of people who come across them. Thank you so much. Aguas frescas, they look tasty <laughs> for sure, George. Thank you. The